Number nine. Point D in that film lies on AC such that line BD bisects angle ABC. Find DC to the nearest tenth. Okay, so this is a lot of letters, but all it's saying pretty much is that there's a point on AC somewhere such that whenever you draw the line from B to D, I'm going to do my best straight line. Oh, that wasn't very good, but you get the idea. Such that when you draw this line, the angle here and the angle here are going to be the same. So it's going to cut angle B in half. And from there, we just want to find DC, or this length right here. So, like with any triangle problem, there's approximately 100 different ways you can do it. But I'm going to show you the best way I think you can do it, and that's with the angle bisector theorem, which should make sense since we're bisecting an angle. Okay, so to use the angle bisector theorem, basically what it says is, um, let's say, let, let's use this angle right here. It says that the side adjacent to it, so that would be AB, divided by the side opposite from it, which would be AD, equals, now we're looking at the other angle, equals the side adjacent to it, divided by the side opposite from it. So it's both adjacent divided by opposite. And then this is just for the angle on the left, and this is for the angle on the right. Okay, so we just have to see which one of those we know. Uh, in a previous video, I think we had to find the perimeter of this triangle, so I'm not gonna go through finding all of these angles, or no, not these angles, all of these sides, because on a test you would have already done that, but basically you just use distance formula. Um, okay, so AB was 12.649, AC was like 12.649. That's not a 12, that's a 16. 12.649, and BC was like 17.889. Okay, so let's see, what's AB? AB, it looks like, is 12.649 divided by AD, which, here's what I'm going to do. We're looking for DC, so I'm going to call DC the variable X, and then AD will be the total length of AC minus this little portion. So AD will be 12.649 minus X, and then is equal to BC over DC. So what's BC? 17.889 divided by DC, which is what we're looking for. That's going to be X. And now we have this equation. And you could solve this normally, but because we have a calculator, I'm going to take advantage of it. Um, okay, so I'm going to go over to my student software real quick and go to my solver. So on the left, we have 12.649 over 12. 649 minus x, that's the adjacent side divided by the opposite side for the left angle. And now for the right angle, same thing, adjacent side divided by the opposite side. Adjacent 17.885, wait, what did I have? 17.889, okay, close enough. And then that's divided by x. And then we're just going to solve for x and see what that gets us. So we get cd, or what was it, DC or CD, one of those two, has a length of 7.4, and I believe it was rounded to the nearest tenth. And yes, we have, we get answer choice E. All right, so if you have any questions from other tests, make sure to leave a comment, and I'll make a video with a solution. With that said, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.